that antique road show. We were, uh, I was watching it with my lady friend one day, and mm-hmm. it's like there was this guy who wheeled in this cabinet, <laughs> and the two appraisers are looking at this thing, and they are raving. They're going, I've never seen anything like this. This is the greatest piece I have ever seen in the 10 years I've been working on Antique Roadshow. This is a singular piece of history. It, if, it went, you know, if you were to put it on auction, it would go for $250,000 easily. This guy was so mad. Like This guy's like, yeah, we done? He was like this crabby old man. He's like, okay. What? Like, he's, like the beauty of that show is sometimes when they go... Like yeah, my uh, great aunt had this thing, and she bought it for seven dollars, and it sat in the house all all the time. And then I got it, and I just kept it around because I love. Oh, this thing is worth uh, thirty five thousand dollars. <laughs> like the person, like some s- slob, starts crying because this is their tick. That's real money for them if they were to sell it. And then this guy was just like, "Yep." He's like, "So are we?" He literally said, "So are we done?" Yeah, yeah, we just told you this thing's worth a quarter of a million dollars that you had uh, sitting in your barn. <laughs> like, we literally just made you rich right now, told you how to get rich. Yeah, fix this one little leg on the thing, uh, cost you $1,000, and then you could sell it for a quarter of a million dollars. This guy was like, he's like looking at his watch, like, all right, I gotta, get, I gotta beat traffic. <laughs> so I gotta go to some auction now? Yeah. I gotta put this on a truck? I miss my shows. <laughs> that, that what you're saying? What you're saying is more work for me again. Yeah, that's <laughs> all I get. More work for just say more work for you. Let me hear you say it. <laughs> all right, thank you. Yeah. Goodbye. You're gonna buy it from me right now? <laughs> well, no, that's if you put it on auction. Great. <laughs> I remember reading some Vanity Fair article about. Joe DiMaggio, what a horrible human being he was, Mm -hmm. and he was that kind of guy, like somebody gave him like a free Cadillac for doing some kind of sponsorship, (laughs) and he looked at it, he goes, is there gas in the tank? Just just horrible human being. So mad. That's so great. (laughs) With that antique roadshow, could you imagine that they're showing you the cream of the crop on that show? Mm -hmm. Could you imagine the line hour upon hour of these guys having to just like wait a hundred people 200 people 300 people lugging the most worthless garbage to like some convention center just like imagine the poor family dad is saying this thing i bet you it's worth something i bet you it's worth something dad it's garbage no we're going to the thing i bet you it's worth something everyone's straining to lug this thing Oh, they're driving. They get a, a, a thing. You can't park here. You got to carry the thing a half mile through the parking lot. They're dragging it in, and it's like finally they're online. They're pushing the thing five feet at a time as the line it's moves one of up. Those, those corral things. So they got to keep yeah. turning a corner with this <laughs> exactly. really unwieldy yeah. thing, and <clears throat> like scraping the floor. Oh, God. Then, then finally, they got a front guy who goes uh, like, uh, "Yeah, that's worthless." <laughs> Now they're gonna drag. <laughs> they're gonna drag. It. Yeah, is there anywhere we could throw it out? No. You know there must be the biggest sign on earth at that thing saying like, "No, like you cannot throw you things away." You must take things out. And also, uh, yeah. I'll, I'll you get will the be show. arrested. Okay. <laughs> if you leave a rug, you will. We have pepper spray. People leaving ru- unless the, the antique roadshow people just get the like world's biggest dumpster. They're just like, yeah. we got to get a dumpster. Although, you know, I, I, I'll give the show credit because they could totally go American Idol and do special episodes of yeah. biggest letdowns yeah. in, you know, and just oh, no. do an episode of people coming in and yeah. my great aunt uh, survived the Titanic going down and kept this doorknob. Well, it turns out she was senile. This is a doorknob from a quality yeah. inn. I, I think she told you it was a... But you, you, you'll see yeah, yeah. it matches the doorknobs over on that <laughs> wall over there. She was crazy. And I'm sorry, you can't. Yeah. <laughs> and they put sound effects on it. Like, burp, 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 burp. <laughs> yeah, the sad trombone. <laughs> yeah, if, if they could. I mean, that show still has clarinet music over the... Mm-hmm. Like, that's a very gentle show. Oh. Antique road show. Yeah. All these lines are lit up. Oh, Lord. 